Okay, guys, it's time to hit the road. So we're gonna hit um, oh Sealy, Texas first, where we're gonna meet Stephanie and her youngins and her youngins' friends, and then from there we'll just turn it into an adventure. So stay tuned. Okay, folks, we met up with Stephanie and her youngins in Sealy, Texas. And uh, so we're ready to go. You ready to go? So guys, we made it to the uh, Spotsil Brewery, but first things first, our stomachs were growling, right? Been on the road for a little while now. So we had our lunch and our first Kodak moment together. So we're here at the Spotsil Brewery in Shiner, Texas. Let's go on in and take a look around. So guys, as you walk into the, um, I guess the gift store area, you'll notice there's a little theater to the side where they talk about the uh, you know, rich history of the, the brewery and all of that. And here's a good little scan of the, um, <clears throat> excuse me, of the gift, gift shop. It's uh, probably one of the old kettles they used to brew the beer. And there's a bar in the back to uh, sample the various beers they, they produce. So uh, we're going to save the grand tour for another video.
Let me narrate a little tour of the Bucky's in Luling, Texas. It's pretty much the same layout as the uh, Bucky's that I showed you guys in that um, Bucky's video a while back. Nice pastry area, and further on down is the meat section. And then they have a lot of, you know, gift items for sale. And this seems to be more focused on Western stuff, whereas the uh, Bucky's tour I did in Texas City was focused a lot more on, um, you know, the beach and that type of thing. Home decor, and this is where you order your food. So guys, we made it to Seguin, Texas. Seguin is the home of the biggest, world's biggest pecan. So we're gonna have our Kodak moment over there. So meet us, well, just meet us up by the big pecan. All right, we all smiling? You see, we had to stop off at Habby's Bakery in Castorville, Texas. It's one of those old German bakeries, very, very famous for that area. We stopped there to pick up Stephanie's birthday cake. You know, Stephanie, you know what's so good about having youngins old enough to drive and follow you behind in their car? What? Are we there yet? Are, are we there yet? Are we there yet? We don't have to hear that. That's for sure. And we don't have to listen to them fighting. <laughs> They're all fighting in the other car. So guys, I think I'll just update you a little bit. We just left Hondo not too long ago. We're still heading west on Highway 90 and we're heading into Uvalde, uh, uh, Texas. Uvalde, Texas was famous for a uh, guns and liquor store, combo all in one. So buy a gun, get liquored up and have some fun, right? So I'll meet you over there.
Ladies, I'm so sorry, but this is a liquor store. You have to be 21 to enter. So here's what you can do. Next door is the gun shop. Y'all go pick, your, pick yourselves out a nice gun, okay? So I have a question for you. A lot of people stop by here because they see the sign guns and, and liquor. So do you see a lot of that activity? Yeah, with people come, trying to get their picture taken over there. Yeah, a lot of people so. come in here. That's why we're here. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a lot. Well, folks, I hate to disappoint you, but there's really no more guns here anymore. How long ago did they uh, stop selling guns? Do you know? About eight years. Ago. Eight, eight years ago? I first came down here and I saw it about 2001, I think, or 2000. Thanks. Okay guys, so as you saw, we had our little fun at the um, gun and liquor store. So anyway, uh, we found an HEB, so we picked up some groceries before heading out to the uh, Rio Frio River. So we'll see you in a minute. I'll tell you what guys, um, tomorrow morning I'll give you a, a, a more grander tour of the grounds. So uh, wait till then. But hey, we got hamburgers coming up. That's good. So being the man in this new cave, I knew my place. It was here. The fire and the meat. Yep, folks, those burgers were good. Those are some happy faces, some happy bellies. And we had jelly beans for dessert. Everyone loved them. I got them at Academy.
Good night, Alan. Say good night. Can you bark for us? Francis Kiefel and I approved this video.